This morning we're reading from Faith Checkbook. And it's from Second uh, Samuel 5.24. It shall be when you hear the sound of marching in the tops of the mulberry trees, then you shall advance quickly. For then the Lord will go out before you to strike the camp of the Philistines. There are signs of the Lord's moving which should move us. Then is the time for us to be more than ever astir. It is ours to fight the Philistines at all times. But when the Lord himself goes out before us, we should be especially valiant in the war. The breeze stirs the tops of the trees, and David and his men took this to signal an onslaught. And at their advance, the Lord himself smote the Philistines. Today, may the Lord give us an opening to speak for him with our friends. Let us be on the watch to avail ourselves of the hopeful opening when it comes. This may be a day of good tidings, a season of soul winnings. Let us keep our ear open to hear the rustle of the wind and our minds ready to obey the signal. Since the Lord goes before us, we dare not hold back. You know, lately I think we've been talking about you know, just being sensitive to, to God. You know, follow follow His leading. And truly, you know, f follow what we feel Him telling us to do. You know, that's, that is so important for us as, as, as Christians. You know, to truly follow the, the moving of God. And Mama's brought up uh, for the li little while now the quenching the spirit. That's not a good thing to quench the spirit. And like he titled this listen for the signal. You know, we need to listen and watch and, and feel and just you know be sensitive to the to the moving of God. You know don't be don't hesitate on uh you know, giving somebody uh, an encouraging word or just listening. Um, that may be, if we feel the Lord prodding us to do that, then that's just what that person needs. And it may be one of us, you know. Yeah. But especially if we're, if we're out and about, and, you know, we shouldn't hesitate. We hesitate. Um, not only does the other person lose out, but so do we on a blessing. Let's pray. Father, we love and praise you today. And Father, we do thank you so much for your goodness. And God, I pray that you would help each one of us to you know, just be, be sensitive to, to your prompting us, to your moving, Lord. Just help us not to quench the spirit, but you know, to, to listen and and to seek your moving, Father. Help us to step out in faith today, Lord, to do what you would have us, is to do what you would have us to do today. Father, we love and praise you. In your most high name we pray. Amen.